real short. It took you by surprise, though. <laughs> your nose gets itchy when you're nervous. Sometimes. It's pretty cute. No. What's up, everyone? Andrew Bainey here with my lovely fiance, Serena. It's been a year, and you know what that means. It's time for Serena's yearly appearance on the channel. She does exist. She is a real person. And she's here. I'm um, always here. I'm just well, never on camera. Sure, sure. <laughs> so what we're doing on today's video is we are going to be, well, not we, but Serena will be guessing a bunch of breakdown call-out lyrics, some of which I think are fairly easy, some of which I think are pretty hard, and which I honestly probably couldn't even guess. And those are my favorite ones because it's always funny seeing what she comes up with. Last but not least as well, if you're interested in Dungeons and & Dragons and metal, Serena started her own apparel company called Illusory Threads. She designs all these logos herself and you can get them on t-shirts and all that good stuff. She did a bunch of different D&D classes like Wizard, yep. uh, Ranger, mm -hmm. Warrior. Nope, not yet. Um, <laughs> so Wizard, Ranger, Rogue, Cleric, and one more right now, don't I? We're professionals, we swear. Druid! <laughs> Druid's the other one. Um, currently I have Barbarian and Paladin ready to go. I'm working on Fighter to get another release out. So those shirts should be available soon, but the uh, the first shirts that we mentioned, those ones are available on illusorythreads.com. And the link to that is going to be in the description and the pinned comment below. So if you're into D&D &D and metal, go check it out. And then of course I got my own Deathcore Dudes merch as well. <laughs> so the only other thing to mention before we get started is basically how this works is I'm going to play each clip of the song about three times. If she guesses it earlier, then we're just going to move on to the next song. If it takes her all three guesses, we'll hear it three times. It's pretty simple. Guess the lyrics, try and get it right. We'll see what you come up with. So with all that being said, let's get on to it. The first song is Chelsea Green Sing to the Grave, one of their newer songs, and it sounds like this. <laughs> Thoughts? Those aren't words. <sighs> let's give it another go. Okay, you don't want the hint? Nope, not okay. yet. Okay, Chelsea Green Sing to the Grave, number two. <laughs> Not your day. Ooh, no. Okay, <laughs> is it the right amount of words? It's the right amount of words. Your was right, the okay. beginning and end were not right. Oh. Three words, one word is correct, two words are not correct. Third time's the charm, let's go sing to the grave. <laughs> Well, I'm gonna throw a title word in there, and okay. I'm gonna say it's on your grave. No, <laughs> unfortunately not. No? No. What is it? The lyrics are, now you're free. <laughs> Hear it? No siri bob. No siri bob. Okay. No siri bob. Well, it is what it is. No, I think and, you're lying uh, to me. You don't have a choice but to take the L on that one. I think you're lying. Zero for one. Real quick before we move on to the next breakdown, I just want to take a real quick break to talk to you about something very important. So breakdowns are cool and all. Obviously, that's what we're talking about in this video. But the reason why breakdowns hit so hard and are so heavy is because of the song surrounding them. And speaking of songs and song structures, my friend Henning Pauly, otherwise known as Pie 42 on YouTube, has just released an almost but not quite complete guide to songwriting. So what this is, is a massive guide to songwriting, which includes over 52 hours of video tutorials. It is available as of today, so right now you can go check it out in the link in the description and the pinned comment. And what this course is, is it is broken up into four different sections, which are harmony, lyrics, writing, and real writers. The course covers multiple genres, not just metal, but of course there is metal in there, but it also has classic rock, singer-songwriter stuff, like Disney musicals, and a bunch of other genres as well. The introductory price for this course is $300 if you go check it out right now, and also, if you buy it within the first two weeks of the songwriting course going live, you will be entered into a pretty massive giveaway. This giveaway is valued at around $4,000 and includes about $3,000 worth of gear from Sweetwater, which includes a guitar, microphones, audio interface, studio monitors, and a bunch of other crazy stuff, and also about $1,000 of additional supplemental material from Spectre Academy, which includes courses on drum writing, programming, and stuff like that. So if you've been looking to up your songwriting game, or maybe you're brand new 
to songwriting, please go check out the link in the description and the pinned comment below. Henning Polly's an awesome dude, his channel is great, and if you're not familiar with his channel, go check out some of his videos because that'll give you a good idea for his sense of humor, his style, or lack thereof, and what you can expect to see and gain from this course. With that being said, let's get on to more breakdowns. Okay, next up, song number two. This song is called Immolation of Night from Invent Animate. Really good song, one of Johnny's favorite songs. Fun oh, fact, not fun that that fact. has any impact on anything. Nope. This song is awesome, it sounds like this. I am I am enough? There you go. Yay! There you go. First try, baby! Woo! Let's Haven't go. quite lost it. <laughs> <laughs> so the lyrics are, I am enough, and it sounds like this. I am enough! Okay, next up, these are my favorite ones because it's Carcosa time. It's my band. Serena never gets these ones right, even though she is very familiar <laughs> with mine and Johnny's voices, obviously, because she has no choice. He, she hears us screaming through the vents upstairs yeah. all the time. So this is a clip from Carcosa's newest song titled Born to Lose. And if okay. you like Carcosa, by the way, go check us out. We're pretty cool. But anyways, Born to Lose sounds like this. And I definitely was not kind to you on the selection of- No! <laughs> no, you were not. I was like, what's the part that is the hardest to understand? Oh, God. Um, Any guesses at all? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Do you want the hint now or do you want to try again? I would like to try again, please. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Calculating. Um, I feel like it starts out with get them over. No, no. none of those words Oh, occurs. good, good. There are four words. Four words. Final listen, born to lose. <laughs> thoughts? No. No thoughts? No thoughts. You gotta make a guess, a wild guess. <sighs> Is the last word rise? No. I don't know. You gotta make I a got, guess. Uh, so I can put your Get them guess, some more fries. Get them some more fries. Honestly, I wish we said that. <laughs> it is set your world ablaze. Sure. Isn't Johnny the one that talks about enunciation? enunciation. I should all put the time, that clip on or... the screen. I like to enunciate when I scream. I really try and enunciate every word that I say so that if a new listener comes through, they can pick up on my lyrics. Okay, next up we got a song from the homies, Fox Lake. Spent a month with them on tour. This is their song, Dog Eat Dog. I think this one is easy to understand, but it is a lot of words. Oh no! So that's what makes it hard. So we'll see how you go. Fuck! Dog Eat Dog, Fox Lake, let's fucking go. All this talk, it's not real until you hear the, 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 the. He's like basically talking. Yeah, no, he is, but it's too many words for my small brain. <laughs> Does it start with all this talk? Yes. And it ends with ba 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 ba. Yeah. That's <laughs> not lyric. I mean, it is lyrics. I but can't remember the in between yeah. part. Because he does like a gun thing at the show. It's very cool. I saw the show. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it was very cool. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all this talk, something. Ba 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 ba. Okay, Ready? we need the something in between. See if you can get it on take two. All this talk, it's not real until you hear the, 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 the. It's not really. <clears throat> so close. Oh, no. All this talk, it's not. Okay. One more word? Uh, no, there's more than that. Oh, fuck. Okay, well, hit again. <laughs> Just focus on that part. <laughs> Final take. All this talk dog gets not. Eat dog. All this talk, it's not real until you hear the, 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 the. I can't. It's not. You can't hear it's it? It's not really in something? So close. Okay, it's all this talk. It's not real until you hear that. Ba, 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 ba. Oh. This talk, it's not real until you hear the, 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 the. Yeah. 
love those boys, miss them a lot. If you're in Colorado, go check them out. Uh, continuing on the trend of songs from bands we toured with, next up is Victims with one of their new songs, Bitter Pill. I think this one's pretty easy, I think you'll get it, but let's see. Bitter Pill, Victims, let's go. It's real short, it took you by surprise though. <laughs> <laughs> That's not what I was expecting. <laughs> um, can you play that again? <laughs> yeah, take two, Bitter Pill Victims. I'm fighting order and order to You got it. No. <laughs> no way, really? I thought this was uh, one of the easiest ones. Something in honor? Uh, no. <clears throat> Okay, no. so I'm hearing like something in honor and honor and fries. <laughs> Why is it fries? I apparently I'm hungry. <laughs> Final take, Victims Bitter Pill. I'm fighting order and order to you can't hear that. No. Wow. Okay, interesting. Well, let me know what you do think you hear. I told you already. Let me hear it again. <laughs> Something mm. in honor and honor and fries. I find it harder and harder to breathe. I find it honor and honor and fries! Okay, I can hear that. I still hear fries at the end. He does say, breathe. Yeah. Breathe. Yeah. Good old metal vocalist making yeah. up vowels where they don't exist. Mm -mm. The finale of our tour package, Within Destruction, Death Wish, a classic slam, deathcore, whatever the fuck song. Very hard to understand. Yep. But let the title of the song be a hint as to what one of the words may be. Okay, so a little context. That end part when he's like, bah, 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 ignore that shit. Oh, that, okay, that part thank is God. Not included. Just the big, like, mm, 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 mm. oh, good. Okay. If that makes it any easier. What was the title of the song? Death Wish. <laughs> Okay, um, how many words is it? It is four words. Four words. Okay, can you play it again? Yes, Death Wish, take two. I want to die. There you go, <laughs> Death Wish, I want to die. Yeah, what Holy a shocker. Shit. Who would have thought, right? Who would have thunk? So yeah, the lyrics are, I want to die, Death Wish within just <laughs> And that was the song me and Johnny went on stage to every night. Oh, Good times. and what were your lyrics? Uh, what the fuck is up, motherfuckers? This is fucking Carcosa, fucking 2023. I don't know, I just made it up every night, basically. Next up, we got Boundaries, one of my newer favorite bands. And the song is called Realize and Rebuild. Again, I think this one is very easy, but those are usually the ones that stump you, so we'll see. A little bit more wordy, a little less screamy. That's the trade-off. A little bit more wordy. A Easier to understand, screamy. but more words to figure out. I'm so bad at remembering lots of words. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, let's go. Realize and rebuild boundaries. I have so much to get. Rebuild. Like, there's no way you didn't get one of those words, at least. <laughs> I have so much to give. Rebuild. You got it. Perfect. Nailed it. it. Yeah. So this is boundaries, realize, and rebuild. The lyrics are, I have so much to give. Rebuild. Rebuild. I have so much to give. Rebuild. It's so epic if you hear it in context of the full song. <laughs> okay, I believe <laughs> you. Next up, nearing the end of the show, we only got three left. This one is by Motionless in White, and it's called Slaughterhouse. His vocals are pretty nasty in this part, though, so it's a bit hard to understand, but let's go. Slaughterhouse sounds like this. One mutilation under God! One mutilation under God. There you go. There you go. I like these lyrics better. <laughs> like the, you like the high pitched scream is easier to understand, right? I think so, I guess. I don't know. Victims was kind of high, though. That's I true. That Maybe not. Maybe I don't know what is going on with your brain. I have no idea. I never know what's going on with my brain, so. Same. Okay, we got two left. We had to obviously include the almighty Lorna Shore, uh, which obviously means you're probably not going to get it. No. But that's more fun. So this song is called Cursed to Die Okay. from Lorna Shore, okay. and it sounds like this. Okay, so that second half when he's like, don't worry about that part. Only the first pass okay. stuff. Does it say to die in there? It does say to die. Okay. Those are the last two words of the phrase. Yeah. Take two. Take two. Take two, Cursed to Die. Hey, at least I'm not making you learn the, the end of that. Is it my turn to die? Not quite. 
two die. The last two words are correct. Well, hang on. How many words is it? Uh, six. So I'm missing four. Yes. Okay. Ready? Final yeah. try. What are your thoughts? It's not enough words, but if I return to die. Mm. Good guess, but it's in our nature to oh, die. Interesting. And it sounds like this. I tried to pick a part that was like at least possible to guess, because yeah. I could have done that next part, which nope. is like, no. I would have no idea what he's saying there mm -mm. either. Nope. 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 Okay, final one. Most challenging one of the whole video. Are you ready? Mm -mm. No. Well, that's good, because I like hearing that, because it makes oh. my life more fun. <sighs> the last song is called Curse Us by Paleface. Mm. They're from Switzerland. Mm. So not only are they screaming, but they do got a little bit of an accent. So it's double challenge. Thanks. Yeah, no worries. It's also the most words out of any <laughs> one on off. this whole list. Fuck off! <laughs> the song is called Curse Us by Paleface. It sounds like this. You can never fucking kill me, you cowards! Cause I am the fucking cursed one! Peace! No, does he say peace at the end? He does not say peace at the end. He says a different word than I thought he did, which was originally, I thought he said bitch. He does not oh. say that. I feel like I had some of the words There's and then lost them while listening to the Try and get the like the words. first half the next listen and then the second half the <gasps> listen after that because you got two left. And don't make me count these words because there's a lot and I can't count very well. Okay. Okay. Take two. Curse us. You can never fucking kill me, you cowards! Because I am the fucking cursed one! Peace! You should never kill me, you fucking cowards. Something the cursed one. Peace! <laughs> That's yeah. like a lot of it. Some words are not right. M most of it is though. Well, that's nice. You're almost there. I think you can get but it. But I don't know which words I'm missing. <laughs> okay, so you got, you can never fucking kill me, you cowards. That's right. Okay. And then I can't remember what you said for the second part, but you said cursed ones and that yeah. part's right as well. Okay. So you're missing like three words. Like and you then, have almost what, all of it. Then the last and then the last word. word, which honestly, I don't think you're going to get the last word because okay. it's weird as shit. And I would not have expected him to say that. Okay. So, okay. So you got, you can never fucking kill me, you cowards. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Cursed one. Mm. Okay. <laughs> You can never fucking kill me, you cowards! Cause I am the fucking cursed one! Bitch! Uh, Cause I'm the fucking cursed one? Yes. Does he say boots at the end? That would be hilarious. He says, <laughs> he says pricks. Oh. Which I would not have expected. To me it sounded like bitch. The yeah. whole time I thought it was that until I read the lyrics. Oh. So it's you can never fucking kill me, you cowards. Cause I am the fucking cursed one. Pricks. Pricks. <laughs> You can never fucking kill me, you cowards! Cause I am the fucking cursed one! Boots! <laughs> or boots, whichever you boots. prefer. And that's it for today's game show. As usual, I'm bad at math, so I don't actually know how many you won and how many you lo lose, lose, lost. So that's gonna be on the screen right now. 